Hey, what's up guys? Captain Jack here, and welcome back to another episode of Bus Simulator 2016. Or, Bus Simulator 16, actually. Um, yes, today we have... We have a job to do. As you remember, last episode was a bit of a grind. <clears throat> Before that was a bit of a grind. I got fed up with the grind, so I did a load of drives, made enough money, we can now go and buy the Bendy Bus. The Bendy Bus! Super bendy, super fun bus time. Auto ramp, yes. So this one has an auto ramp for disabled people. Which is pretty cool. And it's bendy. 62 seats, so lots more passengers, lots more money. And it's going to have a driver as well. So we're going to buy that. Boom. Done. Now we have new drivers available. And, if we get rid of that for a second. We also have... Uh, new dip depots, new depots available. I'm not sure how you get to depots though. Um, yeah, I don't have a clue. I'll have to figure that one out. But I need a new driver for my new bus, so let's let's go and find some new drivers. So we've got Bernard Matthews. Surely he should be on a farm somewhere. Bachelor's degree in psychology, no bus driving experience at all. Really into progressive folk mail. Novice. Probably not. Cheap, but probably not. Skilled car mechanic who worked for NASA as a driver, but can't tell the difference between red and green. Again, probably not. Uh, started four different bachelor's degrees. Used to participate in drag races. Enjoys a lot of small talk. Yeah, see, he's going to be... He can start things but never finish them. He is a bit of a boy racer, even though he's old now. And... He'll sit there chatting away to the passengers all day, making me no money. Skilled car mechanic, worked as a conductor for six years, so she knows buses. Likes happy people, others not so much. So she's not going to be too good dealing with the the kind of people you do tend to get on buses. Let's put her down the end. We've got Milo, Mil Milo Milton. Dropped out of comedy school, loved to take the bus as a child, really likes spicy chocolate. That's different, but yeah, he seems okay. Has a bachelor's degree in psychology, no bus driving experience at all, likes happy people, others not so much, no. Christine Matcher, started as an actor and couldn't handle the fame, worked for NASA as a driver, passionate physicist, loves neutrinos. This isn't the right job for her. Dieter Moore, began as an apprenticeship as Baker, little experience as driver, is really into progressive metal, no. Ricardo Schlushy, skilled car mechanic, played bus driver as a child, passionate physicist. See, he's more like it, because... He's into buses. And he's a mechanic. So as an actor, going to handle the fame, drag races, and that's a no. So it's really between him and probably him. I'm going to go ahead and say um, this one, I think. You're hired, sir. Ricardo Slushy. And then we need to put the bendy on this route. So it's got Ricardo Slushy on it now. Uh, have a buy a bendy bus requires reputation unlock and drive it on a fast route. So I need to drive it on there and then assign a driver. Well, yeah, it's under 10 minutes for the um, interval. So we match what we need to match on that one. But I think I have to drive it with the bendy. It's only a short route, but this is going to be fun. We'll do a quick start, and let's get on with it. Oh, lovely. It's nice and crowded today as well. Brilliant. Let's have a quick look at the bus. That's the wrong, the wrong key. Oh, it's huge. Need to put one of my liveries on it soon. Let's have a look at all the controls. So we're going to want you on, and it's quite a warm day, so let's put the temperature down a bit. Awesome. Let's get moving then. Oh, it, it takes off quite fast for a bendy. It's a bit jerky. I have um, adjusted my... Wow, look at it go. <laughs> I've adjusted my sensitivity. It still doesn't quite feel right, though. I just can't get it to feel like it did before. With the other controller. I don't know why. Unfortunately, that controller's never coming back because it doesn't work with this anymore. Well, it doesn't stop as fast, though. Oh, the doors. One regular week. Oh, you want a regular week. 33 quid. You're going to be 35, so it's two change. Off you go, buddy. 
You're welcome. And you. One, two, three. And left of the gate. And let's go. Hopefully we can make this journey okay. There's one big corner on this um, on this route. And then quite a bendy, twisty road. Oh, God. So we'll see what this bus handles like. Yeah, I think I need to take the sensitivity down a little bit more. I don't know what it is about this controller. Definitely going to need some adjustment, though. I'm surprised that even the bendy section uh, kneels. Anyone? Oh, they are getting Can on now. Please? One senior, one trip. Thank you. Thank you, dear. You're welcome. I guess it's literally just her. Let's have a quick look at that. Yeah, that does as well. Okay, so button three does um, both the rear doors. Oops, wrong button. So this is where the big test is going to be. I'm going to go wide like that, and then Next cut in. Stop, Junction Street West. No, stop pressing the wrong down button. Oh, damn, when I'm driving, I only get that view. Actually, no. I can't remember what the control is for the uh, other views. I'll have to try and remember that later. But it seemed to make it round. I didn't feel any curbs or any bumps. It's a bit flinchy on steering, though. Junction Street West. Perfect stopping position, really. You say so, game. Half my tail sticking out. And the front's over the line. Getting on? No, you're not getting on. Anyone else getting on? I guess not. Let's go then. All clear for pulling out. Right. Let's see what we're like around the bend. Next stop, Cold Convention Center. This is the last stop. Make Definitely sure still a bit twitchy. Oh, get through that quickly before it turns red. Bing. I'd like to get off the bus, please. It's not been too bad a journey. I really thought it was going to be a lot more busyness. Lots more traffic jams. I did turn the uh, the chance of getting random events like um, hot days with lots of passengers and uh, people needing the wheelchair around. Things like that. I, I turned all the chance of getting that kind of stuff up. Wow, it really wants to... Look at it. It really wants to go. I think with a steering wheel that wouldn't be too bad, but with a controller, especially with this one being as twitchy as it is, it feels like it wants to flip. Jeez. Oh, I think I caught something. Passengers don't seem to mind, though. Well, there you have it. A quick little drive with the Bendy Bus, nothing major. I will see about getting it on another route, or maybe even buying another one eventually. But um, yeah, that was quite good fun. Hello and good day to you. Oh, hello. Now you can access the industrial district. Just one more step. Beat this one and you'll get it all. The industrial district is actually a little quieter during the day, but wait until it's rush hour. Oh, and as a heads up, I read in the news that City Hall is coming up with new smog regulations. Talk to you later, kid. Why do you keep coming back? I own your company now. Let's close that for a second. So our income now is massive, but we're still not on the... Well, we're at 24,000. That might have... Um, I can't remember what that thing was. But once my driver has taken over this route, and I'm driving that other route, so all my routes are being driven, all my current routes are being driven, then we should start to get more money in. Which is all good. Let's go to the map screen. Close that for a second. 
But of course that doesn't include all these new ones. So this is going to start to bring more money in. But I'm going to have more expenses because I need more. I've got more buses I'm going to need now. Which means that this route, I'm, I'm going to have to make routes on here. Yeah, 24,600 in one drive session. What was it that I just made? Oh, get bent on that. So what do we got to do then? Yeah, now I have access to the industrial district. It's not the most beautiful place in the sea, but a lot of people work here. If you manage to provide a good commuting route, you will be granted access to the inner city district. Have a route which has at least tw uh, two bus stops in the suburban, residential and industrial districts and drive it at least once. So suburban, industrial and residential. Well, that's suburban. That's residential and that's industrial. So it doesn't care about um, modern for that one. Which is good. I can do like something up here, through here, along this sort of seafront road or riverfront road, and then into this district. Um, have a fast route that has one bus stop in each unlocked district, maximum seven stops. Drive it and then assign a driver to the route. The drive interval needs to be 10 minutes or less. Wow. Don't know how I'm going to manage that. I suppose if I steal this road. If I'm quite good, I might be able to do something along the lines of that one, this one, that one, and then go up here to that one. Maybe. Might work. We'll figure that out anyway. Comply with the regulations for smog. Own at least four modern buses which apply these regulations 2010 or newer. Oh, what? That's going to take forever to do. What are all my buses? 2005, 2008, 2005, 2005, 2014. So my, my Bendy bus is the only one that meets the new requirements of 2010 or newer. Great. And how much are the um, are there other... What? I don't know. Do I... Did it say? Yeah, they have got years on them. So I basically need to replace all my buses with at least one of these. With the three doors. Got the old two door. And that's the three door, isn't it? Yeah, I don't own any. No. What do I? Yeah, I do own one of those. That's the three door. Yeah, that's the three door. These two are both two doors, I think. I don't know. I'm, I'm thoroughly confused now. So, anyway, I'm going to have to sell... Yeah. So that's the, uh, so I've got three of the old buses. Yeah, that is the three door. And then that is a, a different one that I don't have at all yet. So I've got Bendy, which is new. And then I've got three of the old ones and then one of the slightly newer ones. And I need to sell all of those and buy these. And what's the, um... That's probably just going to make it sell. Yeah, that's what it's worth. Damn. So basically, I've got lots of money to make now. Lots of routes to build in. This is where the game is going to get slightly complicated. And I'm going to have to figure a lot of stuff out. But anyway, I'm going to leave it there for now. Um, I've got a lot of work ahead of me in this game. I'm going to have to figure a few things out off camera. And then, uh, yeah, come up with some something good. <laughs> But yeah, I'm going to leave it there for now. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this. It's it's going gonna, it's gonna to get a lot of fun soon. So um, thank you very much for watching, guys. And I'll see you all in the next one. Take care and bye-bye.